pitch up in the zone. He throws a fastball that's got a little extra skip on it. And uh, Wati. So the first batter at the a veteran from Japan. 1 1. Thomas not going. Polanco pops that one up. Center field. Jones is there. And a good in since growing up. Out of Sacramento, California. Runner going and a chopper that's going to be a base hit into right field. A perfect hit and run, intended or not. Ball is bobbled on that wet surface. Marquegas will get it back in. Ordonez at a 15 inch. Stymier players. Two ball, two strike delivery on the way, and he got him. Cabrera goes down. 0.91 ERA at AAA. 3 1 delivery on the way, and the bases are loaded. So he has walked two. One grand slam home run. Delivery to him in the air to left field. Reimold is there. And Hernandez works his. Throwing four with a ERA closing in on 10. And Brian Roberts will kick it off for the base hit. Played by Ordonez and Roberts. Most important, he still has the best batting average against right handed pitchers in Major League Baseball. Shattered bat down to third. Inges up. There's one. Relay over to first. And they get the. Look through all the raindrops and pick up the baseball. Yep. Mark Agus takes the heater and you know, it's that at the end that explosion. One two delivery and got him. And 14 pitches 84 of them strikes in that last outing Buck was talking about. Three two delivery down to third base Melvin Moore. Times at a 340 average a big powerful switch hitter. Down to first base. A one to be reasonably upbeat obviously disappointed about the way he pitched. But I think he understands exactly what the deal is. He needs to go down there and pitch, have some good innings, rebuild. Staying in your zone, doing what you do. Don't let the rain change how you pitch. Grounded towards third again. In just got that one. There's one relay, Polanco, and there's two. A little double play in each field as he is. Luke Scott's going to get some DH work. 1 1 delivery on the way, and a towering fly ball to center field. Granderson going back, wanting track wall. Goodbye, home run. He has done it again. Luke Scott with another dinger, and the Orioles have a 1 0 lead. Home runs in his first taste of Major League Baseball. Swung on. It's a pleasure. I appreciate it. Got to tell us a little bit about. Uh, a youngster who played not only one sport, but apparently, as most athletes do, a lot of sports. And about when the decision came. You where he grew up. Uh, the bear, the bear family actually took Goldilocks to court for breaking into their house. And during dress rehearsal on the day of the production, Brad Ball was pulled out of the strike zone. That one in the air to center field. Jones getting over, and he's got it. He's absolutely right. That is, that really has never changed. Here's the 2 2 delivery to Zahn and swung on a miss. Geller League level working on it. Yeah, you know what happens, I think, Gary, is a lot of these players are specialized, and there's a specialized player right there. Is he doing a number at the bottom of that lineup? Base one down, Brian Roberts. Orioles up one to nothing. Roberts lifts that one high, but not deep to left field. Cleek Thomas. Freak I was supposed to do with my foot. Adam never has any of those problems. And Jones chasing. And a chopper towards short as tourists. It's dropped him out of that leadoff spot. And the 0-2 delivery is a shattered bat base hit into left field. Grimold will come on. A dying quail right there for Granderson who will pick one ball, one strike count. Down to third and hard. Melvin Moore, Taylor made five, four, three. Today, yeah, two yeah. to one today. A tough ball game today. Jeff Neiman lost. Ground ball towards second base. Polanco will range. Marquez at first since 06. This late into the season. That one caught Huff. And Aubrey will take first base. That is the third hit batter. Tiger pitches down in the zone very effectively, and we've talked about the improved infield defense for the Tigers. That's going to be a broken bat base hit up the middle. Granderson on to get it. Mora's got a hit. Mora, very short lead at first base for Mora. 2 1 delivery to Scott. Towering fly ball to right field. Maglio Ordonez. And he's got it. More versatility and a little more athleticism. 
That's going to be a base hit. Nick Marikek is over. We'll have to play it off the wall. Larish on his way to second base. And he will go in with a. In very effectively and has stretched out this outing. Laird will take that inside. Hernandez. 2 2. He does show it and he does drop it. And they got to play a third and get the out. His fifth year of professional baseball. He is out of Jacksonville, Florida. 25 years old. Up the middle, that is a base hit. It is slow down on the wet grass. The only play is going to be at third. Jones throw to Mora. Not quite. A perfect throw on the hop, and they might have had a play, but that one skipped away, and Mora had to block it. And this game is tied in an RBI single by Cleveland. Oh. One down. Infield, double play depth. Polanco hits the pop up. Third base. Mora. Ball came back to him. He strikeouts in 43 innings and 13 walks. Here's the 0 1 pitch. That one in the air to center. Jones going back. Adams got a bead and he's got it. He's the last yeah. rookie to have a walk off homer in the extra innings for the Orioles. Reimold is now in that place. And maybe, maybe, way back, left field. Goodbye, home run, Nolan Reimold, 2 to 1 0s. Not Octavio shot his fifth. Greg's on shallow center. Granderson. He's got it. So he continues to do a tremendous job for the Orioles in that nine spot and the center field. Granderson will not get it. Knocks it down. A two for two ball game. One down. Brian Roberts. Roberts rips one. That's going to fall in for a base hit. Adonis cuts it off. And the Orioles getting to Galarraga. Four up, a homer, and two singles. The Orioles threatening to have a big inning. Jones up. That one in the air to right field. Maglio Ordonez. He'll get it in a position to throw and does to the cutoff first. Mike Agus the other way. Cleet Thomas. And he's 434, slugging percentage of 623. Swung on and missed. Lengthens the work of your pen. 1 2 delivery. And that's going to be a base hit. Well, Granderson continues on. Three times up, three times on, including. Make a catch on the short hop, and that's what costs on the air. Infield is in. 3 2, and he walked him. Four. Offensively, he's hitting the baseball. 2 1 delivery on the way, and a towering pop up. Got a chance for a big out here. Melvin Mora. And he's got it. And walked in and the bases are loaded. So Albers comes on. Walks the first. One and two now. Bases loaded. Two down. Santiago's gone. Strike three called on the inside corner. Matt El I understand he's uh, coming. Tomorrow night. Okay. That ball hit in the air to right center field going over Ardonia's not going to get it. Aubrey Hoff on his way to second base. He will cruise in with a stand up double. His continuity. They're real baseball games and I don't say that negatively. That one looped in the air to right field. Ardonia's coming. Not going to get it but he fooled Hoff. Hoff's going to go anyway. Here's the throw. Ardonia's off the relay and he's safe. Maglio Ardonia's deep to Aubrey Hoff and he's a pirate. Yeah. 1-1 one, one delivery on the way, a towering pop-up to right. Huff will tag. He's not going anywhere. Ordonez. Department. Here's the 0-1 delivery. Ground ball towards third. Knocked down by Ames. There's one relay over to first. Great play. It will deny the three ball, one strike count. Albers, the leadoff batter, will take it down low, and it's a walk. It's Justin Verlander and Jason Birkin and Edwin Jackson Sunday afternoon. Bunt and a beauty. Roberts trying to get there. Huff. Ooh. Ivory Huff turned to his ball game tied up in the seventh inning. 
Albers the 1 0. Shattered bat. First base. Nice play. That ball had spin. Huff gets it. Johnson ready to go to work. Try and protect the 2 1 lead. And got the pop up to second base. Brian Roberts. And he's got it. And given up 10 home runs this month. But they need him to get sorted out. And that's why he's back out here pitching in the bottom of the seventh. And uh, we saw the youngster make some fine plays with runners on base, holding this Tiger offense down uh, with the as hot as they've been. Again, he goes down the line. This one, though, has got 133 average in the first 11 games of May. Takes that one to left center field. Ball is carrying out there tonight. And Granderson will come over to Gibson to strike out. And now Jim Johnson working to his second batter. Granderson is gone. Compared to 232 on the road, the biggest difference going in the league. Down to third base, Melvin Mora. And an error. Runner not going, and the pitch is up high. So Johnson, first and second, one out. Down to third, Melvin Mora. It's redemption time. There's one. Double play. Very comfortable atmosphere. 3-2 delivery. Jones down to third, and he's got a base hit. So a leadoff single here in the eighth inning, and he will extend his hit streak to five to his last outing. 1-1 one, one delivery. Marquez in the air, left center field. Granderson and the left fielder Thomas will take it. Jones tags the throw, and he is in. And walked him. Here's the one two delivery to Mora. And he's out of there. That's what he was brought in to do and did it. No. A lead off single by Jones. He's at second. Hop for the walk at first. And Scott takes that one to center field. Granderson going back. Warning track wall. Goodbye. Home run. He's got one hot. Luke Scott, a three RBI homer in the bottom of the eighth inning. It's called out. Big boost for the ball club off the bat of Luke Scott. Towering pop up, Polanco with the angle. Luke Thomas and Polanco. 2 2. A looper to first. Ivory off. And Johnson came on for an inning and a third and uh, gave up just a walk and had a strikeout. Going back into the well, Jones has won their ball game today. 0 oh, 2 count and the delivery to him, swung on grounded to Sherrill. He'll make the play in the books for the O's as they beat the Tigers 5 to 1.